Hey everyone, I was looking for a decent gimbal to add to my kit to get some nice handheld shots of uh, various things even when I can't be bothered to take a tripod, a big camera and a slider with me uh, and that's quite often. When you look around online, the DJI Osmo 3 is one of the most well reviewed and most often recommended gimbals uh, for smartphones, so I thought I would pick one up for myself. One little snack. Videos shot on the ultra-wide lens have the motor in it. One of the reasons to pick up the iPhone 11 instead of the Pro is to have a more vibrant colored phone. So to not hide it, you put it on a silicone case, which makes the motor show even more how to fix it. The hard way. One way to work around this issue is to remove the phone uh, from the case. That would not work for me. I've got kids and uh, they absolutely destroy everything with glass on it. Just a few days ago, uh, they managed to smash my wife's uh, 11 Pro. No thank you. The other workaround is to shoot the wood ride uh, with the motor showing and crop it out in post. Doesn't that kind of defeat the purpose though? Uh, I would think so. You can also try to work the phone off balance on the gimbal. For short bursts, that's something you could try. Uh, but for longer shoots that will uh, both drain the battery in the gimbal faster and make the motors overheat. Not ideal. How to fix it? The easy way. So the proper solution is really that simple. Have a look at one of those uh, counterweight kits you can uh, get in various places. I got mine from Amazon for about £12. When I made my purchase about two months ago, Ulanzi was the brand attached but uh, now you seem to be able to get it under uh, various brand names. Frankly, they all look like the exact same product uh, at very similar price points, so pick up the one with the more uh, convenient shipping or lower cost. After installing the counterweight to the gimbal, you can balance your iPhone 11 with the silicone case still on it in such a way that the motor is no longer visible in the shot. I tried using only one or two of these weighted screws but uh, I seem to need all three to balance my phone properly. Why this all matters? If you have an iPhone 11 and want to shoot the ultra wide lens for various gimbal shots, you'll either need the counterbalance or you can live without the ultra wide camera or try any of the other hacks. Conclusion I wholeheartedly recommend picking up a counterweight kit for your DJI Osmo 3 if you use a phone that has uh, problems with the ultra wide shots. Interestingly, the iPhone 11 Pro Max appears to work without these weights just fine. Given the kit is a fraction of the cost of uh, the gimbal and unlocks the full use of all the cameras on my iPhone 11, I think it's one of, the, one of those no-brainer picks to add to my gimbal setup. Bye!